everybody, welcome back to my channel and welcome to another video. So welcome back to another sit down video, I apologise. A lot of my video ideas recently are involving me sitting down and talking to the camera so apologies for that first off. However, if you're an autumn lover then you're going to love this video. If you're new here, welcome, my name is Shannon and my favourite season is autumn i think i say this every year and then i get to winter and i'm like winter's definitely my favorite season and then it goes to spring and i'm like spring is definitely my favorite season but no i generally think the aesthetic of autumn is my favorite so today we're gonna do an autumn homeware haul so we're gonna get started straight away i've gone to three different stores i went to tk maxx the range and next i found some really lovely things in all of these by the way i did also go into home sense where i found that most of the stuff was just the same as what they had in tk maxx so i didn't actually end up getting anything in there if I had my own home, I would have bought loads. The fact that I've literally got this one box room to work with and I have three bags full of stuff is quite embarrassing. But I bought some stuff because currently I'm not doing too much. I'm waiting for a lot of things to happen. To be fair, by the time this video goes up, I'm probably actually going to be really busy. But at this moment in time, I'm not doing too much. And I thought to lift my spirits... I would decorate my room with lots of autumn bits and I'm very excited. You can definitely tell that we've hit autumn now that I'm filming this because it is chucking it down with rain outside. Anyway, I'm going to start with what I got from the range first. It was actually the last place I went to but I found some really lovely bits in there. So I'm going to start with that and the first item I got was this cushion which is adorable. I love this colour. It just screams September and October to me, so I was all over it. They actually have bedding to match this, and they didn't have it in a single. And I currently have a single bed at home, so oh, if I had a double bed, I definitely would have bought it, but I suppose it's sort of the universe telling me to stop spending money, so I will listen. So it's really, really soft, and then it's got these tiny little gold pumpkins on it everywhere. That's exactly the same as what the bedding had as well, and it's just so, so soft. It's adorable, and it's just like perfect size as well. I think it would work if you had two of these on a double bed, but even on just one of these for my little single bed. It's going to look so cute, so I'm really happy with this. This cost me... Good question, Shannon. Check the receipt. £8.99, so I don't know if that's a good price for a cushion. I'm very new to all this spending money on homeware stuff, but I was willing to pay that for this cushion, so that's item number one. So the next item I got from the range is these. So they're three tiny little velvet pumpkins. And I just thought they'd be so cute to put like on the windowsill and there's a few other things that I think is going to match really nicely with it. They're like sparkly as well. So that is just what one of them looks like on its own. I think it's super cute and it just comes in a little pack of three and it cost me £3.49. And I can already picture them on my windowsill and I think they'd be really cute like wrapped in like a wreath and lights. Which leads me on to my next two things that I got from the range. So the next thing I got is this. It's basically a little pine coned garland and... It's adorable. The colours of it just scream autumn to me. And they've got these tiny little pine cones all over them. They come in like a big line as far as I'm aware. So yes, there's one end of it. And it comes in like a, a whole long line. So if you wanted to, you could curl it up and like wrap it on the door, which was my first option for it. However, it is like perfect size for my windowsill. So I'm thinking I could whack this on the windowsill. Add the little white velvet pumpkins, which is adorable. And then add the last thing that I got, which I'll show you in a second. And this was £3.99 from the range. And I just thought it was really cute. I kept seeing reefs or like garlands. And they were just either really big or there's too much going on. And they always just come in like a circle and you couldn't do anything else with them. So this was perfect because you can kind of do whatever you like with it. And I'm thinking I'm going to wrap it on my windowsill and I'm going to add these to them. This was the last item I got from the range and I think it's going to fit perfectly with the last two things that I just got. And it's some little pumpkin string lights. But they're just like really minimal. So th there was a few other ones but they had like the big scary faces on them. And I'm not really going for the Halloween theme as such. I'm going for the more of the autumn theme. And look how cute they are. I just thought they were really, really cute. And they're just really simple. Oh, they have got a face on them. But not enough that they're not cut out almost. Can you kind of see the face it's got on it? Slightly. But it's not enough to sort of scream Halloween. It's still very 
september -y, october -y autumnal vibes for me so i cannot wait to put all of that together on my windowsill because i think it's gonna look really cute they cost me 5.99 by the way and that was everything i got from the range i'm now gonna move on to tk maxx all i got from tk maxx was candles and i don't have enough room in here for this amount of candles. If any of you actually know me personally and have been in my room, you know my room is a box. I mean, you can see it already. That's my door. I am at the windowsill already. And then where the back of those drawers are there, that's the wall. And then the end of this, you can see it there just briefly, where my Polaroids are. That's the other wall. This is all I have to work with and I bought so many candles. So we're gonna move on to TK Maxx. So I got four candles, just four candles from TK Maxx. I have more coming by the way. So the first one I found was this one. So this one is a sand and fog candle and it looks like this and it's this sort of like, I don't think the camera's really doing it justice but it's got like a pink tinge to it and I just thought it would match with the color of my room really well. This one cost me $8.99, you'll be able to tell from the the price tag at the top anyway but it's got this like pinky wooden feel at the top and then it's got this really cute pumpkin in the middle god knows why they put the price right over the design on the top it's actually cinnamon pumpkin wow i love sweet smells so anything pumpkin spiced cinnamon anything that's like would be in a dessert basically anything that you think i could probably eat that Oh, it smells good to me every time. I think there's like a hint of vanilla in there as well, which is really nice, but it is cinnamon pumpkin. And it's a two wick candle. Wow, smells so good. I cannot wait to light these. I feel like I'm gonna have to like whack Hocus Pocus on in the background whilst I'm decorating my room. I feel like that is the ideal autumnal day. That is gonna be perfect. So that was the first one I got. The next candle I found was this one. And it's a DW Home Cafe Creations vanilla pumpkin latte candle this is what it looks like the writing on the front is really cute i do love the designs of these but it is literally just plain white this one cost me 7.99 and it is vanilla pumpkin latte so i'm gonna have a smell oh that is so nice there's a few that had a lot of coffee smells and i'm not a coffee drinker and i don't really like coffee at all i really liked the idea of them but they smell horrible to me whereas this one it says it's a latte and you can kind of smell the coffee a little bit but it's so good. But the actual reason I got it was not because of the smell, it's because of the design on the top. So that is the design on the top of the candle. And yes, I know it's like, it's a pumpkin, Shannon, but is it or is it not giving you Cinderella vibes? Absolutely. And I know obviously Cinderella's carriage is made from a pumpkin, but if you go around Magic Kingdom in Florida, I've seen it on vlogs, they usually have like the Mickey pumpkins. Well, they've been having the Cinderella carriage pumpkins now for obviously the celebrating the 50th anniversary for their halloween decorations and that is exactly what it looks like and that is the only reason i picked it up and then i found this other one that i literally bought because it matched that one honestly um, i don't understand me sometimes but this is another one that i got this one's 3.99 and this one is a pumpkin spice latte made from the same company same design but it's got this on the front which i thought was really cute i love that but yeah this one's pumpkin spice Oh, wow. You can smell the coffee more in that one than you can in the vanilla pumpkin one. But that is still so nice. It makes me want to eat it. So that was the third one I got. And last but not least, I don't even think I even stopped to smell this one. So I need to smell this one. But I just had to get it because of what it's called. And it's called pumpkin cheesecake. But look at the little... That's so cute, isn't it? This is also a DW Home one as well. And this is what it looks like. I just love everything about the look of this. I think it's so cute. It's not got a design on the top like the other ones do. I'm so excited to smell this, okay. Oh, that is so nice. That one's actually like really minimal. It's not as strong as the other smells. So that's just perfect. Oh, I love that. I had to pick that one up. And that one is $7.99. And that is everything I got from TK Maxx because I literally, like I said, just got candles. Anyway, moving on to the next one. I went to Next Home and I found some beautiful things in there. So I'm gonna show you those next. <laughs> I'm gonna show you those next. It's from Next. God's sake, Shannon. Okay, so from Next, I got three things. And these are the last three things of this haul. I did get a few more smelly things obviously but one of them is a candle one of them isn't and i'm going to show you what the other thing is it's one of these i don't even know what you call these 
but I'm going to actually open it properly and show you. That it says on the tag, which please, which I love. And I think I'm going to actually put this in the living room downstairs because I don't think this is going to fit with my room vibe, to be fair. But I actually got it because the basket that all of the, the good smelly things are in has got some really cute designs on it. So I'm going to open it properly and show you. This is going to get messy, I can tell. Okay, there's a word I look like. How adorable are the colours in that? How cute so on the bottom it's just sort of crisscrossy it's almost reminded me of like a witch's cauldron but on the top it's got these leaves how cute is that you've got some pine cones in there you've got some shaped bits in there that bit's a little bit scary i'm gonna turn that to the side because is there a phobia with that i can't remember the name of it please tell me if you know the name of that phobia and i had a friend that actually suffered with that it's stuff like with like crumpets that you can't bear the idea of trying to eat a crumpet because of all the little holes in it. Let me know what that's called if you know what it's called. Um, so yeah, sorry. Apologies for that if you did just witness that and you have that phobia. I've put it to the back now. But it's cute, right? I love the little leaves on the top. I'm really happy I got this actually. Oh, the smell is not what I pictured. It's definitely got more earthy tones to it rather than the sweeter smells. That is really nice. But yeah. That's that, and that cost me £12. But the candle that I got is super cute. It looks like this. You can already see the price on there. It's £12. But how adorable is that? It actually looks like a little pumpkin. It's got this, like, woven look about it. That's the material. It's very dangerous. I feel like I'm going to smash it. And I haven't actually smelt this one because, obviously, it's all packaged up. Does it say what it is? Oh, my God. It's so cute. It's called Sweater Weather. Hence the... The cable knit look about it okay so it says top notes berries orange the heart of it is honey apple and the base is vanilla caramel burns up to 40 hours it says a sweet red apple top note sweetened by spiced honey and cinnamon <gasps> nesting on a gourmand base of creamy butter and caramel this is what i mean by the sweet smells it, literally that sounds like a dessert to me Oh wow, oh you can smell the apple. That is so nice. I actually think that might be my favorite now. That's quite a pricey candle, it's 12 pound for this candle, but also, it's not just the candle is it? Look at it, <gasps> it's a cable knit pumpkin, that's adorable. I'm so glad I got that. I actually ummed and ahed about that as well, why? Why, that's so cute. And the last thing that I bought is one of my favorite things it's this cushion i just love it so it's got these like little twist knot design all over for the pumpkins and then at the bottom it says hey there pumpkin and it's this like beigey creamy color as well and most things that i've been seeing have been either bright orange or white and obviously the last cushion i got was like a really nice burnt orange and it's probably quite bright and isn't really going to fit with my room to be honest but i'm hoping with the a few orange candles that i've got are gonna help with that but this just fits with my room perfectly and i just loved it and this cost me oh did it wow oh okay 20 pounds can't believe how much money i've spent on autumn decorations for my room my literal box room wow but that is the last item that i got and i think that's so cute and yeah that is all of my items for this haul so thank you very much for watching i love all the things i've bought kind of regretting spending the amount of money i did but also i don't think i will once i've actually decorated my room i don't think i'm gonna regret it at all if i can i will link everything that i bought in the description down below so you can have easy access to it and go and get yourself some nice autumnal decorative bits for your room because it's made me so happy today. <laughs> anyway, that is the end of the haul. So I really hope that you guys have enjoyed it and hopefully found some little bits that you might want to get. And I'm going to love you and leave you. Thank you so much for watching this video. Remember to like and subscribe. And I will see you in the next one.